everybody. How's it going? I see I'm I'm uh, redoing my beard thing again here. Why not, right? But anyway, I'm making a, I'm gonna make a really quick short video on um, I wasn't using my grill the other night, and I noticed my auger wasn't turning. So I'm like, oh great. You know, I've only had it for I've only had this smoker for like uh, maybe two years or a year. So I'm like, oh, let's let's we gotta dissect this. So I got off work and. Dove right into it. I will show you what I did, but, but I should have started from the beginning, but I'm just gonna kind of explain what I did. So you got what you guys know when you guys have this issue on what to do. All right, so I'm gonna flip the camera around and we're gonna go over there. All right, here you go. Anyways, this down here was plump full. Like, cause you, you're supposed to clean these things every once in a while, you know, not, not like once a year, but like every few uses. But anyway, back here, See, I had to take this plate, this box off. And in, and in here is your auger. Okay, here's your little fan motor that turns your auger. It's kind of a weird looking little thing. This thing just sits right here and kind of wobbles around a little bit. And then your auger goes right in here. You can see that. You can't see it in there very well, but anyways. Basically what happened was I had a clog. And I'll get all my goods right here. Here's the auger. Here's the auger. It doesn't seem to be in good condition yet. Basically all it does is slide right back in there. And how I had to get it loose is there's a little tiny uh, bolt, little, little bolt, little cotter pin or whatever goes inside there. And it gets held off a little nut and then this. Uh, plastic piece goes inside of that which like a bearing or something holds it in place in here but there is actually like two there's like a bunch of screws underneath also underneath here they get to take loose to pull this this whole thing unit off but all I really did was just kind of keep wiggling it back and forth and then I pulled it out and, and then all a bunch whole bunch of burnt stuff came out and I just kept going back in turning it pulling it back out and I got it loose so yeah now, now my process is to put it back together and then try it out <coughs> so yeah really quick simple little fix hopefully it works and I get it back put back together so I can use it this weekend maybe that was just kind of like a little just a quick little go over on how to unclog your grill so yeah if you have any more questions, just leave a comment below and I'll get back to you. Other than that, I'm going to get this baby put back together. We'll catch you this weekend sometime. Also, I forgot to mention the main thing. Crack open a cold beer before you start this process because either it could go well for you or it could be a nightmare. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe. All right, we'll catch you next week.